Hello everyone, my money game here. We are back with more Legend of Gaia. Uh, last time I said I'd meet you over here at the um, place I just forgot the name of. <coughs> yeah, Mount Dehini. And um, this place is actually pretty simple. Uh, if you go there, you can click something that will tell us to continue on, how to continue on, and that's why it's there. Uh, but first, go ahead and save here. There's no reason why you shouldn't. And I guess fight a battle, too. <laughs> Can't really complain about that, really. Alright, there's Mishura and Iota. Iota is a very strange ability, to say the least. Um, anybody can use it. It's a dark type, kind of like Nido. Um, but it has the most interesting of all the uh, animations. Oh no, he's Earth type, that's what he is, yeah. I think if I remember right, he is the most interesting of all uh, animations. So yeah, only get him if you absolutely want it to, because it's not required for this area. They need for any stretch of the imagination. But he has a very interesting attack, so um, I'm going to try to get him. I don't think I'm going to be able to. To be honest. The, um, a guy I looked up online said, use your most ultimate power attack against him, kind of like a hyper art if you have the AP for it, and then follow up if it doesn't die, follow up with a normal art of some sort, you know, to finish it off. So, yeah. It also says that you're more likely to uh, get an ability the higher the level you are, which is actually kind of ironic because um, I'd have to say that's not true because the higher level you are and so is it, you do more damage, this means you kill it faster, so I don't know exactly. I don't know if she had it or not, that's why I tried to get her to get it first. <coughs> remember, using magic at all makes it almost impossible for you to get it. I, forget, I keep forgetting if I told you that or not. <coughs> if I have told you, then good. I don't want her to attack it, so... Spirit, spirit. Okay, I had a power punch in there, but I guess it overrid it because of something else in the list that was probably going to cause it to be a double, and so he didn't do the attack. That's something I hate about this game, like I said before, if I've ever said it before. Um, this game likes to screw you over in its um, animations. Whenever it's like, oh, he has the, um, like, let's say, for example, the uh, cross kick ability. He can't do the cross kick ability, but he also has another ability that he can't do either. So, like, apparently. So, we're not letting him do any of them, and that's just ridiculous. I don't know why I'm doing that. It's a waste of MP, but I don't want her to attack this thing. So, yeah. Now that I've gotten it so close, I believe. But from how hard, how tough I am, a tough time, I mean, I'm having to getting it, <coughs> I'm down in HP, it's probably not going to be meant to be in this fight. I can always put an ivory book on. I have the actual golden book on uh, Noah right now because uh, I need gold because, you know, I'm so low right now. So, yeah. I think the person that got it last time, Iota, was Noah in my uh, personal playthrough, so I don't know. Maybe I'll try giving it to her <coughs> this next round. Yeah, we just healed. Uh, let's see, equip. 
Vitality Ring, Life Grail, and Guardian Ring, that's fine. Um, <laughs> I am getting rid of it for a reason, if you're wondering. I'm sure someone's going right now. He just got rid of what he said he needed. <laughs> no, no. I don't really need it that badly. I'm just getting... I'm just doing that because... Mm. Oh yeah, I was going to equip the ivory book. I was like trying to figure out what I was doing. We'll put it over this for now. Trying to carve it in the door of the gate. Sacred land of the Soren. None may climb without the mark of the Soren. Soren flew inside the satchel, suddenly began to shine. I hear a voice from Birdman Gate. Let's open those with the mark of the Soren. Cool. <coughs> now, if you don't mind, I'm going to try to get into another fight with an Iota here, so let's see if we get lucky. I'm not the only one that does this, by the way, so... <laughs> yes, I did! Alright! Let's have him spear it up so we can get plenty of opportunity to kill it. Don't accidentally attack it with her. And, um... Bullhorns. I really need another Vitality Ring for John, because he's going to need one. Soon enough, but I just can't get a break with that. Have to get 2,000 uh, coins to be able to buy uh, two of them if I want to get one for my whole team, which would be a really good idea. But, oh well. I'm surprised both of them didn't kill that thing. That's crazy. <sighs> Alright, let's try this. Let's try Fire Blow. And that will leave us with um, 20, right? So we can do this afterwards and then just rustle it the rest of the way. Uh, let's have her use Orb on us for no reason and have him try to attempt to finish off the uh, bison. <coughs> now I don't know how exactly the ivory book works, it didn't really say in the thing that I was reading. I'm sure it just makes it the requirements go down a little bit, so it's slightly easier. But still, I don't know. I like the attack animations from that it has though, it's pretty awesome. <laughs> 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 1543, nice. Man, that thing does a ton of damage. <laughs> Alright, let's try again with uh, something different. Let's do Hurricane, and just a couple arms after that. No. You Spirit. And you Spirit. Get up! Ah. Alright, that was my one attempt, so I'm gonna go ahead and re-equip the uh, item I had before. And, um, yeah, we'll continue on to the top of Mount Dahini. <coughs> well, actually, no, because I think there's more chances for us to fight it. So let's just head on uh, through. I think this whole area has them around here somewhere. Uh, nothing over there, nothing over there. So let's go over here. Okay, there's another one. Oh, I just smacked my mic. I'm so sorry. I was trying to uh, scratch my cheek. <laughs> I know that sounds weird, but it's true. Okay, 
let's see, um, cross breath, and, sure, let's do, uh, oh, I don't have enough, I thought I did. <coughs> but I can barely hear the game right now. I mean, I know that's a good thing, because that means it won't pick up on the mic, but... I'm also trying a new, uh, setup. I got my computer right beside me instead of in front of me like I usually do. And I'm setting off a little bit to the right of my TV, which is kind of interesting. I'm telling you, that's the kind of luck I've been having right now. That's why you need to have target chains on a lot of your teammates who have, if there's enemies in the field that can actually block. Yeah. It's a good idea. Let's just get a little bit of healing for him. So I just remembered that I don't have the life grail on him anymore. <coughs> I know it's kind of strange to be using Vera at this time. The main reason why I would only consider it here is if you're not needing the whole team healed and you just need a little bit of healing for one of your partners, so yeah. I mean, even at the uh, final area in the game, it's still useful. That's what's so cool about it. <coughs> And they don't hold anything back on that final area either, so I mean that's saying something, you know. <sighs> um and that should do it. As I said, I have no idea how much HP these things have, so... There we go. We got the power of Iota. This used to be one of the favorites in the, uh, in the personal playthrough that we did. So, um... Especially if it's the one I think it is, then yeah. Let's take a look at it. I always do that. Magic. Odd Dimension, yes. Attack all enemies. It's... Now, it has more... It uses more MP than Kamaro. And so that should tell you something right there. It's like, you're probably thinking, Oh, that means it must be slightly more uh, advanced then. Or like, you know, better in that, in that, in that meaning. But no, actually it's not. Um... I think at the most it does the same amount of damage as a, um, unholy icon. Sorry, that's my ADD kicking in. I'm just kidding, I don't really have ADD, but I swear, uh, there are times where I just see something and I'm like, ooh, you know, <laughs> I have to point it out. Ah, penetrate an enemy's defense. I don't think it does anything else, but if you put it on, like, I don't think it harms you in any other way. Let's see. Stats, Mike, 342, 249, 241, yeah, I think that's about the same as what it was before, so I don't think that's a danger in any fashion, but what was I talking about, um, yes, Odd Dimension, um, like I said, it sounds like the spell, since it has more MP, is going to be a lot more powerful, but I think the most damage it can do is like 800 to multiple people, let's use it here just to, you know, of course show it off, now that we got it. You do want to level it up a lot because it can be very useful later on in the game, despite what I'm bragging on it about. So, um, let's use this. So I'm kind of curious how much damage it's going to do to these things. Yeah, it looks really cool, in my opinion, what it does. So Iota comes out with this very trippy 
animation here. <laughs> then using his trippiness, he uh, brings him into a different dimension. Then explodes him. So, yeah. As you can see, it did do a pretty decent amount of damage. It did way more than I said it did. I guess I thought it was something different. So, my bad. But yeah, um, I could have sworn that it was more along the lines of like, it didn't do as much damage as I thought, but actually, a thousand damage can actually help out a lot, you know, so I mean, if you ever need to do an extra thousand damage, you might want to try that, or um, of course, Kamara, which costs less. So, yeah. Oh, and another thing, I found out that um, if you forgot to heal or anything like that, when you go to the, uh, what's it called, the uh, muscle dome, that heal you up before you start, or something like that, because I had full magic when I started, and I didn't have it when I went in, so I thought that was kind of cool. Have I only been recording for 16 minutes? It feels like it's like 25. That's cool. Let's try down here. Then down here. I'm just running a random path, because I don't really know where the treasures are. Okay, um... You go after the bison. You go after Iota this time. And you help me out with that bison. You know, it's kind of funny, I rarely use my hyper arts in um, fights like this. <coughs> but sometimes I just recommend them because, you know, it's like... Once you get to a certain area in the game where enemies are just so tough because of their um, amount of HP that they have and so on, it's actually ridiculous not to use your hyper arts to kind of get the upper hand, you know? So, yeah. I'm sure you need to save your AP for uh, boss fights, but there shouldn't be a boss fight along this path, so, yeah. Keywords shouldn't, but I don't think there is. I cannot believe that thing does so much damage. Oh, no, 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 I can't do that. Um, let's go ahead and use a magic fruit, since we're so low on MP. Use orb so we can level it up. And, um, pull horns against the Neo Bison. <coughs> I'm sorry if I'm sounding really quiet and all that at certain points. Like I said, it's because I'm still recovering from, um... I don't know what the heck it was. I want to say it was a cold, but I didn't have the soreness that you get from having a cold. So it couldn't be... it couldn't possibly have been that. Because usually when I have a cold, I can't do anything. So I would have called into work then, you know? Because I literally, like, can't move. All I want to do is sleep, you know? <laughs> so, it could have been a cold. <coughs> but I have, like, four days off this week, so... That's kind of nice. Yeah, what ended up happening is my boss came up to me and he's like... Oh, hey, Michael, um, we won't be able, you won't be able to work, uh, Wednesday, so, um, is that alright with you? Because we need to cut some hours, and I'm like, well, only if you're alright with me having four days off, and he's like, you're gonna have four days off? Like, he said it in, like, this really, like, are you kidding me? <laughs> or kind of, like, at the same time, concerned, you know, like, do you want me to... Sorry guys, that was my fan falling. I have a fan in the hallway to help cool off the room a little bit and it just fell over. It nearly gave me a heart attack so I thought someone was breaking in. I don't know if I ever told you that, but that's one of my biggest fears is someone breaking into my house. Um, though in every ever like scenario that I think of, I always picture myself um, doing untold damage to the person, so I don't know why I'm so worried. <laughs> but, um, anyway, when I heard that sound, I seriously thought someone was breaking down my door. But, yeah, anyway. 
I'll shut up now and get back to the uh, game. Get up. Yeah! Haha! <laughs> I don't know why she's having so much luck with it. <laughs> yeah, you jump up and down and smile. You're so awesome. Um, guys, I'm gonna quickly go and fix that. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Man, <laughs> two whole minutes of nothingness. That's going to be fun to listen to on my when I edit this and watch myself just stand there. Because <laughs> if I remember, I'm going to be like, wait, what? Uh, this might lead to the top. And if it does, I'm going to have to backtrack to go get the items that I missed. <clears throat> Ooh, two Mashuras. Let me check something. Okay, so I have Mashura, so I can uh, auto-target one of them. She does not have Mashura, so um, but she needs to kill one of them. You know what? I'm going to have Spirit and use Hurricane Kick, just for fun. I mean, why the heck not, you know? Well, it's going to be kind of silly now, because I just realized that... Um, I had both my characters attack a separate one. You know what's ironic? I just realized that I didn't really grind as much as I thought I was going to. I know I said I wouldn't, but in the, uh, you know, frozen area where you have to fight that one Kuro guy that killed me twice. Anyway, <laughs> uh... Or was it three times? I can't even remember how many times it was, but it was ridiculous all the same. But, um, yeah, I could have fought more along the, uh, separated paths, you know, but I chose not to. But that's alright. What am I gonna do? Uh, Vera on Noah. Hurricane kick. So many highs. <laughs> and we'll try it on B, so I think that's the one that took the most damage. I love the word she says, whatever it means. Nice. But it fully destroyed it, which is all well, all well and good, I guess. You know, what goes best together? Is it earth and fire or wind and earth? Like, is it wind that's, uh, like, in a, in another game, if, like, you had the wind element and someone had the earth element, uh, would the wind element do more damage to the earth element because of the whole erosion thing, you know, and all that? I don't know if it follows that logic, but, you know, I'm just kind of speculating here. Because I forget how many other games work along there with those lines, you know? I just realized with the one uh, ring that I have that makes her AP use go down, if I do the uh, her hyper art, it doesn't do 99, it does 50. One hit because it cuts it by half. So, yeah, that'd be kind of interesting. Wait, 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 wait. Was it showing him blocking, but I was still doing damage? How is that? If an enemy blocks you, it takes away all damage. Anyway, that's the end of this recording. Um, I will see you when I backtrack, because I think I have to. So I'll be back in a little bit. Till then, bye.